The Stanley definitely has history of paranormal activity. Welcome inside the world of the Stanley Hotel, a historic landmark nestled in the heart of Estes Park, Colorado. This iconic hotel has been captivating guests for over a century with its luxurious accommodations and breathtaking view of the Rocky Mountains. But there's more to the Stanley Hotel than meets the eye. Today we're going to explore the haunted history of this legendary hotel and cover some of the eerie stories that have made it famous. Out. Since I've been working here, I have heard voices. I've been touched. Um, I've also been made physically ill on the fourth floor. The Stanley Hotel was first built in 1909 by Freeland Oscar Stanley, a wealthy inventor and businessman who came to Estes Park for the fresh mountain air. The hotel has played host to a number of famous guests including Stephen King, who famously wrote his novel, The Shining, after staying at the hotel in the 1970s. Red brown. Red brown. Red brown. But it's not just the hotel's famous visitors that have made it famous. It's also the ghosts that are said to haunt the halls. We hear reports all the time, and I hear them on my tours. I was sleeping on the fourth floor. Somebody let their kids run up and down the hallways all night long. And when I had a nap, I was going to yell at those kids. And when I opened the door, there was no one out there. Some of the Stanley Hotel's most famous hauntings take place in room 217, where Stephen King stayed while he was writing The Shining. Guests have reported strange occurrences in the room, including the sound of children playing to the feeling of a man sitting in the bed with them. Also, another of the haunted rooms is room 401, where guests have reported the sound of a party going on despite the room being empty. One of the most mysterious things about the Stanley Hotel is its mysterious underground tunnels. These tunnels were originally used by staff to be able to move around the hotel without being seen, but over the years they've become subjects of countless ghost stories. Some guests have reported seeing figures moving through the tunnels, while others have felt cold spots or heard whispers in darkness. The Stanley Hotel's ballroom is also another hotspot for paranormal activity. Guests have reported seeing figures dancing in the ballroom when no one is in there, and some have even reported feeling a hand on the shoulder while dancing. The Stanley Hotel offers a ghost tour for visitors who want to experience the hotel's hauntings for themselves. The tour takes guests through the hotel's most haunted rooms and tells the stories of the ghosts who are said to inhabit them. The Stanley Hotel may be famous for its luxury and beauty, but it's also a place where the veil between this world and the next is said to be thin. Whether you believe in ghosts or not, one thing's for sure, the Stanley Hotel is definitely one place that's full of hauntings, and if you don't believe it, then go check it out yourself. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.